Well, you know who we did really well with was Tyrese Halliburton. Tyrese this Halliburton is true. extremely well against the Knicks, and he threw some shots at the Knicks after the game. Oh, he did. Yeah. But you know what? You want to know why I picked that game to watch specifically? Because Knicks fans, the whole week before the game, were talking about can't wait to mess with the overrated and and dunk on and dunk on Halliburton and stuff. And I was like, I, I don't understand why this is a rivalry. No offense, it's like two bottom dweller teams for the past five years going at each other. It's like okay, it's a little bit weird, but I decided to watch. I'm happy that the Knicks got shit on because I don't like the Knicks this year because their fans are dickheads and rude to me on Twitter. But, but that's beside the point. That's beside the point. I just I had to pick that game because for some reason they really hate De'Aaron Fox and they genuinely despise Tyrese Halliburton, who I love seeing take shots after the game. Well, a lot of Knicks fans have been in the closet about how much they love Tyrese Halliburton. He has been one of the best rookies this year. Again, go to TPA, another stat that shows you how well a player has been doing compared to the rest of his class. Tyrese Halliburton is far and beyond the best player in this class as of today, as of today. He has been great. He has been playing out of this world as far as offensively, defensively. He's reading passes. He's reading the defense. He's reading what the offense is running. He is one of those guys that I truly believe can be a franchise guy for the Kings. He can be a guy that can be the guy next to Fox. Now, do I think that that's a reason for them not to tank? No, I think they should still tank. Now, are they going to tank on purpose, Caleb? No, because at the end of the day, when you have a coach like Luke Wallen, when you have the roster that they have, you don't need to tank. You just don't need to. I don't think there's a team that genuinely has tanked on purpose in basketball specifically. The Charlotte Bobcats? Listen, you got to think that no matter what these games. Listen, but no matter what these owners do, it's not like the players are going out there and throwing the game. They're giving it their best shot. They're trying to win. Yeah, they don't but want when a guy you have Cody Martin and Caleb Martin on your roster, what is that? That falls, on bad, that falls on poor coaching, giving those guys minutes. 